Okay, at the moment I have two tables. I have the owner table and I have the CD table. It's displaying in uh, two DB grids. Connection, string, everything was built. Um, what I want to do now is I want to code, uh, let's say, the DB grid one, that when I select a specific owner, that only the CDs that is owned by that owner will be displayed in the CD table at the bottom. If you look at it in uh, Axis, uh, the relationship is one owner can own many CDs. So it's a one-to-many relationship. Okay, so CD owner, you will know that if I click on, let's say, number three, that Curry owns all these CDs. Okay, so I want to do something similar to this in Delphi. Okay, so I'm going to go to the events on self click and I'm going to say data model 2 dot add to CD equals to sorry dot filter equals to um, the field I want to select in the CD is the owner ID so owner ID there maybe a good way will be to copy it and paste it in Delphi then you can't make a spelling mistake owner ID must be equal to okay, let's concatenate another string here I want to say owner ID must be equal to um, data model two dot add to table owner must be equal to the current owner ID of the owner table. Right. So when I'm going to click here on this owner table, the current owner ID must be equal to the owner ID in the CD table. Owner ID over there, uh, owner ID of the CD table. Okay. And I will have to put it in quotation marks because the owner ID field is actually a number field. Let's just check. Maybe it's necessary, maybe not. Well, that is the R. So it's going to be the filter property I'm going to set. And the other thing that you must do is you must make this add table data model 2. Dot I do CD filtered this boolean property you must set it to true so that the filter is on okay so when I click on curry it's going to show the CDs under the in the CD table. So click on this one and it will change and update as I click on all these fields. It will only happen when we click because it was coded under the click.